we had a few new insights regarding how to put our uh, content repository into events and projections and so on. Quite cool. Yeah, I guess the most surprising or difficult thing was to uh, how to actually publish notes. <laughs> how to put that into meaningful events without losing information. <laughs> uh, I haven't worked in content management in I think 10 years or so. Uh, so I was pleasantly surprised to see you know the kind of things Neos does and uh, to see how you know the ambitions you have for the future, which is uh, you know it's 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 quite advanced stuff that you're trying to achieve. And the good thing is that at the beginning of the day we search, we found one pain point that's moving, and at the end of the day we found the second pain point it's publishing. <laughs> so we have <laughs> our two yeah. dangerous area of the product. have hammer factories and then by the end he, he gets a, a factory 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 for building the tools to build the machine we I definitely need that second head that I'm planning on growing for all that input. <laughs> Very exhausting, but uh, it was really a lot of fun, and I never did such a like marathon modeling session. And it's it's uh, even after working years on the, this domain, it's still so complicated and hard to to reason about. Even though we know most of the code, it's yeah. still fascinating how hard it is. <laughs> it's um, quite advanced stuff that we're discussing and trying to do and planning to do. So. Um even though this feels very hard currently and we're probably not getting it right the first time, I still think it's a good idea that we're thinking about that. So what I hope for is to actually combine the two ideas of having that graph data structure that doesn't care about events and having events that don't care about data structures and how the whole stuff interacts and uh, that really worked out well, I think. I can't wait to, 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 to play around with, I mean, it's, it's there's a huge mountain ahead of us, but still already got some ideas for at least bringing my little example next step to explore how it feels in reality. Well, I think the, the important next step is to uh, not just leave, leave it at uh, modeling at a whiteboard, but you know, try some things and see how it behaves in reality and all the things we probably missed. Uh, you know, you, the whiteboard always compiles, so we can draw forever and <laughs> it will look nice, but. Uh, uh, we need to build some things and, and see what works and what, what doesn't. I, I really enjoyed it as well. And um, so, but currently the amount of feedback is still higher than than uh, our progress. So I think there's a lot of work actually. But for me, actually, I've learned tremendously a lot. Um, and I, especially regarding my false assumptions I had in the, in the in the in the beginning. So that was extremely cool. And I'm. For the first time ever, I'm able to think through how it could actually really work, like down to the you details. Think? I'm thinking, I mean, it might not, of course, but still, it's a lot further than what we... So I, I feel this could actually really work out <laughs> sometime in the future. <laughs> right. No, I was happy to see that you already have some experience or some, you know, some good insights in what CQRS is and event sourcing and... Uh, uh, so, you know, we, we basically touched on every possible topic in, in one day yesterday. Uh, you know, and eventual consistency and all these things that typically you, you know, you, you start feeding into a session after a couple of days, maybe uh, in a careful, uh, careful way. Uh, we were already, you know, debating that. And uh, so, yeah, I think you know, there's going to be a lot of work achieving what you want to achieve. But if you get there, it will be amazing.